This is Sophie Heller, and this is an ACT English pronouns question. You see in the sentence, it says, you find all sorts of these leanies, or what the author refers to thin people as, about if one looks long enough. So the important thing to remember with a pronouns question is that you're going to be wanting to use the same pronoun consistently in order to make the sentence parallel. So we see our first pronoun that the author uses is you, which is a second person singular pronoun. So we're going to want to use the same pronoun. The first answer choice uses the pronoun one, which is an impersonal third person pronoun. So this sounds weird to say you find all sorts of these leanies about if one looks. It's not the same pronoun, so that's no good. Choice three is the same thing. It has this one, which is wrong. Another reason it's wrong is that it has a semicolon here. If you take the semicolon, a semicolon is something that separates two separate standalone phrases. So if we were to put the semicolon here, this about if one looks long enough, it's not a separate sentence. So this is bad on two counts. Choice number four is wrong because it uses we and not you. So it's introducing a different pronoun. It's also introducing an unnecessary comma because if we put a comma here, we'll have this weird pause. You find all sorts of these leanies about if one looks long enough. Doesn't really make sense. So let's get rid of this. Choice two is great because it uses you, which is the same pronoun we've been using. So it makes the sentence parallel and it makes a lot of sense. Choice two is our right answer.